odious. Yeah, today we take on Real Madrid. Roll the intro. Right, welcome back, lovely people. Are you crazy here with some more Real Madrid dynamite? I mean, Danish dynamite, but uh, yeah, I'm a little bit terrified for today because. As you can maybe tell, it's not exactly a bad Real Madrid squad, is it now? I mean, they do have Martial, which, I don't know, is that good or bad for me? 13 goals, I just noticed he scored. Of course, they have Usman Dembele, which is just, I mean, let's let's do it right now. Should we uh, make, set nickname? Yes. Figo. Okay, there we go. They have Figo, the French Figo, but um, yeah, as you remember, he... Um, he joined from Barcelona on a free, and uh, he's now, well, I wouldn't say tearing it up, but he's doing all right. But uh, yeah, he's now known as Figo because, well, we all know why. Let's throw some pig's heads at him and stuff, but um, yeah. It's going to be pretty difficult, I think, but uh, I mean, for some reason, right? I say that. I, I, I'm actually, when I think about it, I'm more terrified by playing PSG, you know, Mbappe, Isaac, Kimmich, then playing Real Madrid, maybe I'm just wrong, but Real Madrid, I mean, they're so old, all of them. I mean, they do have Vinicius Junior. Okay, never mind, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna think about it too much, because I'm just, I'm a little bit more confident at playing Real Madrid than PSG. Maybe I'm mental or something, <laughs> I don't know. Right, well, speaking of PSG, that was the last time we saw each other, and uh, yeah, it's been going pretty well so far, or since then, I guess. Uh, wins over... Aston Villa and Leicester both 2-0, which was very, very good. Kim Hansen scoring a goal versus Leicester. That's, that's amazing. Uh, in case you forget, this is our amazing defender that's going to stop, well, the might of Real Madrid, perhaps. I can't remember if he's playing, but we'll find out soon enough. And we drew versus Chelsea away, which is actually very, very good. And then Klaas Kestensen scores, of course, versus his old team. So I guess that's fair enough. And uh, that does indeed leave us at third position in the Premier League, which is actually pretty damn good, I think. Um, still lots to play for, especially like in the Champions League position. But actually, when I say that, I thought this was 68. So we're 12 points clear. Hmm, with five matches to go. Oh, that's actually very interesting. So that would be easy, right? You would consider cha uh, Champions League qualification very easy. You may be a little bit wrong. Because take a look at... I intentionally hid it when I was showing you the Real Madrid. Yeah, there's a West Brom in there. That looks easy. Let's scroll down. So we have Liverpool away, United away, Tottenham away, and then Tottenham at home, which is strange. But this has happened to me before in a save where I had uh, City twice in the last like four matches or something. Obviously, it's just to do with all the cups being rearranged and all sorts. But it's, this is even more strange. These are the last two Premier League matches is versions of Tottenham. Tottenham who I support as well, which is pretty funny. And they're, of course, having a terrible season. I mean, they're up to 14th now, but... <sighs> But, of course, the reason we are here today is to play Real Madrid, so we shall do that, and with a pretty, pretty amputated squad as well. Andreas Kresnes is, is injured, Unlazen is injured, who else was it? Chukwani is injured, might not be a starter, but he would have been good off the bench or something. And then Andreas Paulsen, our super, super consistent left back, is also injured. I mean, at least he's back fairly soon, three days it says, but... Yeah, it's not looking good. And then Narci and Fakir are actually, are actually not really fit for this one. Or are they? Actually, Narci is fit enough for me to put him on the field. So I'm going to put him instead of Benjamin Jensen. And then put Christian Eriksen up in his more familiar AMC role. And this is the squad that's going to topple the might of Real Madrid. Our 18-year-old right-back, uh, Jakobsen. And then our 17-year-old centre-back alongside Nelson. And then Skow on the left-back, of course, because Paulsen is injured. Narty and then Hoybia, Damsko, Eriksen, Darami on the left, and then Paulson up front. And um, yeah, I'm not overly confident, but I mean, if we can beat PSG, why not beat Real Madrid as well? I expect a good result in the first leg. Let's just say that. Let's see if they actually care. Oh, they're actually kind of motivated. And let's take a look at the opposition. 
big yikes. Figu on the right. Yeah, definitely want to do some hard tackling on him. Same with Martial. Do we want Ulegaard? Yeah, probably. And the two wing backs or just full backs or whatever you call them. And that should be that. Come on. Uh, definitely going to have to pay to close attention to someone. I didn't even read who it was, but yeah, let's just do that. As Real Madrid already have a chance. <gasps> Casemiro off the bar. Oh, okay. I'm going to do... Yeah, let's do what I usually like doing versus them humongous teams. So let's put the fullbacks more on a supportive duty. It seemed to work versus... Um, in the Premier League, at least. Uh, as uh, oh, I thought we were going to see a Jimenez there, but no. No, no, no. Okay, I mean, there's... Ooh, Darami. Good, good pressing from him. Go on, go on then. Paulson is in. You suppose some scores? What? Our other turkey is gone too. Something to cook. Really? Ooh, that was terrifying. Bit of context. I don't know if you could see on the actual video. I'm not sure. But you know, as the goal was going in, my girlfriend came. <gasps> yeah. And uh Apparently there was some weird predator that ate our turkey. Well, we thought so, so we had to rush outside. We did find her. She's here. Hello. But yeah, there was definitely some predator happening, uh, trying to kill, well, eat her or eat uh, our neighbor's chicklings. They have new chicklings just roaming about like tiny chicklings. But uh, yeah, of course, we got super scared, so I had to rush out and try and find her. We did find her, but actually, even more context, yesterday... Her mate actually disappeared. So whatever predator is lurking around here ate one of our turkeys. So now we only have one left. Ah, so sad. Anyways, I mean there is a match going on. Let's uh, let's see the highlight because that was a bit stressful for me. I mean, holy moly, my heart is like pumping right now, and oh, it's gonna pump even more as Paulson just slots it in. Yay! We are winning versus. Oh, what are you doing? Real Madrid, holy moly. Okay, I mean, uh, stats-wise, we're pretty dominant, but, uh... Ooh, Eriksson? But Eriksson never scores goals. Eriksson. <gasps> oh, you are my good luck charm, little friend. Yes? Yes, you are. <laughs> well, she jumped up here first immediately, and then now she's over there. I think she wants to eat that plant, but... Uh, maybe not. What are you doing? Good goal by Ericsson. I mean, as you can tell, I'm pretty distracted here, but uh, <laughs> it's going well. Focus, lads. I mean, I'm the one who needs to focus. Okay, corner. I mean, what the heck is going on? Henson now with his fourth goal of the season. I mean, he's really shaping up to becoming a very, very good defender. He's two and a half star now. I think he was two not long ago. Whoa. Okay, she had enough. I mean, and from a corner. Holy moly, was from a corner. Skip the replay. Oh, whew, my heart is pounding and it's now half time. I mean, we are dominating these fools. Dressing room, what can you even say? The only thing reasonable to say in this situation is you might not be winning, uh, but don't slack off or don't drop in performance and all that. Yes, that is what we're going to say. I said put Karim Benzema on for Martial. That is... Probably good for us. I mean, he's <laughs> slow as fudge. Oh, what's going on? I'm being attacked. Wow, uh, you can't quite see it, but she's a bit off camera. Don't, don't click the keyboard, please. You'll just ruin all sorts. She did that yesterday when I was making a thumbnail, and uh, I was in GIMP making my thumbnail design, and she climbed on the bloody keyboard and it did all sorts like it saved the save so now it like it overwritten the save and it i had to spend like an hour trying to figure out how to get it to work again <laughs> so so that was fun yes lie down there okay right well we do actually have a football match going on another oh go on go on lad okay that's very forced but that's actually a beautiful ball to polson uh, he needs a lot of yeah help from there but at least yeah good intent there uh, we're going to make one change here because Dumps is not having a great, great game. Also, he's on a yellow card. Hmm, what should we do? I'm going to put on a new hope here. Peter. I think it's Peter. Yeah, Peter Christiansen, one of our other, other like, uh, regens from, I guess, last year or... No, he's been there for a while now, but yeah, he's shaping up pretty well. 
we put him on because yeah why not carvajal now of course i am wary oh go on I, uh, that was so tense there good defending there again from uh, the rami he's he's suddenly on fire remember how our left wing was a bit of a oh hazards in don't good save from stenov i mean i just don't want to concede a uh, away goal at this point right that would be silly especially since we're playing so well okay well 10 minutes left uh, plus some added time so let's make another change nicholas narty can come on for this guy and he'll be a ball winning defender uh a ball winning midfielder sorry and then what uh, uh what was it we're gonna do we are gonna uh time waste some time yeah sure that should be fine oh we have a corner i'm gonna make a up after this but let's just see what happens as please don't do anything silly just shoot from there or something i don't even care if it's wide i just don't want to get countered upon there's a going out driving it forward not like this fellow viking ah that's a shame that is a shame i'm gonna make the last sub as the highlight is gonna do its dang um which the problem is we don't really have that many players to put on but our players are knackered though which is problem so actually i'm gonna put fakir on for paulson advanced forward he's a bit faster and maybe we can get some long balls in dirami oh that's not good okay, just don't okay the good work there again dirami and okay i guess this is a highlight because i made a change because yeah okay, Militao gets a yellow card okay but the free kick immediately well the highlight continues so <gasps> Please get to that. Okay, I'm getting tense here, lads. Just see this one now. Let's go to a more cautious. But yeah, and then yes, yell focus. I really, especially hate doing ooh, changing the mentality in the middle of a highlight because that usually means that the highlight just is a goal for them. Uh, that's another highlight. Oh, and it starts with us at the back. Terrifying. Please don't cock it up. Please don't do silly things. If they're gonna score, let them. Go on, Fakir's in. I mean, that was amazing defending from uh, Militao there. Okay, just calm down, lads. Okay, let's see this out now. 3-1. Wow, what a result. I mean, we played so well, and then we did let them... Uh, we did get the dreaded away goal, or they did, but I think we played really, really well, considering that was Real Madrid, and considering I'm a little bit distracted here, as the Turkey is doing all sorts. Hmm? What's wrong? Ah, <sighs> my heart. Anywho, be right back with the second leg. I mean, I have to play West Brom in between and then sort out this Turkey business. So, yeah, <laughs> be right back. Right, and we are back. Easy 3 0 win versus West Brom. Kim Hansen getting a goal again, our, well, superstar. I keep, I'm bored of saying it, but yeah. He got another goal, and he was actually voted uh, Young Player of the Month in, uh, <clears throat> in the Premier League, which is good. Let's get his scope as well. He scored a beautiful free kick and then he made an assist. So that's actually very important for what we're about to do because, yeah. Team selection, let's go in. You can see Skull is actually going to play on the right wing. Paulson is back, so I'm, he's, of course, going to play in the left back, but I'm going to move Skull up there. I mean, he had an amazing performance last game, so I may as well play him, right? I really want to play him. Uh, other than that, it's going to be Jakobsen at the back with Hanson Nelson because Christensen is still out injured. Yikes. Of course, Stenov in the goal. Narci Hoivia, go EX and the army, and then use Paulson up front. Pretty familiar at this point, but, um, oh, oh yeah, hang on, I'm just gonna do this one. Next match only, before I forget, point, point. Oh, also, something that I completely forgot, uh, throw-ins, I still haven't done this one. Oh no, set piece takers, throw-ins, so left side is that guy, that's fine. Uh, on the right, it needs to be this guy, point, or Leonard Jensen. On the left, oh yeah, just do that one. <laughs> I'm scared every time I left back, I just see a highlight starting with my left back doing a throw in on the right side. That is uh, pretty terrifying, but um, yeah, let's uh, let's get into it. And of course, do the patented. Uh, we cannot allow complacency to do all the good work done in the first leg. Go out there and treat this as starting from scratch. Indeed, lads, indeed. Yeah, and their team is very much. Very familiar indeed. I mean, it's still Fico, Usman Dembele, but he's now Fico in this save, so that's fun. But uh, yeah, that us. I mean, if we can beat them three-one at home, surely we can beat them away, two-nil, whatever. What a match indeed. Thirty-five minutes. I mean, it's just, I mean, I'm not complaining. The less stress, the better. As my turkey and Queen Margaret over there are having fun.
As, oh, actually, this is the first highlight of the game, so uh, let's just hope we don't just throw it away, silly lily lily. Uh, but yeah, that's probably always gonna happen. Okay, that's uh, scary, Marshall. Yeah, you might be fast, but uh, you can't finish. Oh, and a free kick to us now, right before half time. Let's just go, 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 go on. What is going on? Oh my god, it's. It's a uh, own goal by Uruguay. I mean, there was so much panic in there, right? So uh, anyone could have scored. Let's see. How, uh, Kim Hansen was highlighted there. Was he the one who... No, he heads it down and then all sorts of weird things is happening. Oh, it's actually... Who was that? Is one of the Real Madrid... I can't click him. One of the Real Madrid players kicked it up into Uruguay and then it went in. Um, don't look at the scoreboard and think the job is done. Yes, exactly. And then say, I yeah, have faith. You can still improve as... Hello, Angela! This is Angela Knippenberg. I mean, time is just whizzing by. Nothing is happening in this game. I mean, just focus that. Yeah, I mean, by all means. Oh, and of course, I had this crazy theory. Oh, well, but Skull is going to play amazing. He's playing a 6.1. That is horrendous. Good thing we have Dump Skull then. Put Dump Skull on. Yeah, it seems the turkey is really my uh, good luck charm here. I can't believe we're... Oh, I... Shouldn't have said anything, should I? Ooh, nice ball to dump score. Okay. So they're actually sitting quite deep, the Real Madrid team, which is a bit surprising, but... Oh, no, 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 get to that. Okay, it's Benzema now up front. They've changed out Martial, I guess, yeah. Oh, Vinny Jr., oh, my Lord. That was pretty poor from Stenov, I think. I think he could have saved that one, right? So Benzema with the good hold-up player. That is, of course, why he's on the pitch, right? And then Hazard... Good ball, I guess, to Vinny. If it's so... Ah, Steno, you definitely should have saved that one. You definitely should have saved it. But, okay, I will forgive you for now, as long as we go through. Okay, and we're piling on the pressure here. Ooh, hope you are. Okay, not recycled it. Okay, please get to that one. Hanson, yeah, cool and collected from the 17-year-old playing at Bernabeu. Dump scores in. Oh, my God. Wait, there was a goal. Go, go, go. It was a goal! Look how excited she is! Henson with... Ooh, that was tense! Tense, tense, tense moment there! Hoy, who actually... Paulson with an amazing cross and then dump scores in. I mean, very unexpected, but... I did quietly say that I, I think that... Like, PSG are a lot better than Real Madrid, in my opinion, but I didn't think we would be strolling this much. I'm just going to do a double change here. Uh, Jensen on for Eriksson and then Fagir on for Yusuf Paulson. There's 10 minutes remaining. What could possibly go wrong? I mean, they need four. Four? What is it four? Yeah, four goals. Holy moly. I cannot believe it. Of course, don't really... I can't actually remember who the other finalist is, but I'm pretty sure it's one of the English teams uh, in the other semi-final. So, probably like City or United or something like that. Of course, we're going to check after this match. I mean, we still have to get there. Calm down, calm down. But it's looking... I can't believe we actually won away at Bernabeu. That's what you get when you do a FICO move. Bloody Real Madrid. Congratulations, you're in the final. Holy moly, 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 moly. Holy turkey. For um, Ah, I'm chuffed. Yes, sure. Nice to win. Gives everyone energy boost and all sorts. View the stage then. Oh, it's Chelsea and Liverpool, actually, so not even City. Hmm. Very interesting. Well, obviously, we're going to show you the final no matter what, but I kind of want to just fast forward and see what who the opponent is going to be. Uh, as we actually play Liverpool in four days, so that's fun. But I'm going to fast forward a little bit. All right, and here we go. So it's 1-1 so far. Uh, it was 1-1 at Stamford Bridge, I should say. So uh, let's see. I guess Liverpool are favourites. I guess not, then. Uh, so it's Chelsea. Tomorrow, actually getting on the goal, uh, goal scoring sheet or whatever it's called. Uh, ooh, not too bad, is he? Wow, so it's actually Chelsea. And they're sixth in the league. The, uh, I mean, that must mean we're better than them, right? You would think so. Holy, well, yeah, I just saw this as I was browsing through. There's quite a lot of star ratings on that one. Let's see our own. He, it's not, but to be fair, it was the same versus Real Madrid and PSG and Bolton and Wolves and Watford. Uh, Watford doesn't count because they always wreck us. But yeah, you get the drift. <laughs> Holy moly, so stressful. But uh, yeah, I'm so happy. I mean, 
Now we just go into the... I mean, look at this run of... Not form, but like matches. Real Madrid twice, obviously. Chelsea as well, they're in there. And then Liverpool, United, Tottenham, Tottenham, Chelsea. Uh, I'm not quite sure. And we still... It's not uh, certain yet that we're in the European... Uh, the Champions League, I guess. It depends on the FA Cup, it says. I'm not quite sure. I think maybe the fourth position is possibly like qualifying round. So um, it's not even safe yet, even though we are 14 points clear with four matches to go. So, um, yeah. Going to play a few matches, I guess. Let's do maybe... Let's do United and Tottenham. I mean, it would be pretty boring doing Tottenham, Tottenham, right? <laughs> but, so, um, yeah. See you in a bit. And I hope you enjoyed the episode. And if you did, press like and subscribe for more and all that jazz. And from me and Turkey Town here. <laughs>